character. Now, if you've heard Gabriella Chilmy sweet about me, you'll probably not have been able to get it out of your head. It's that advert as well, Gabriella. It's a, you've got another surefire hit coming up, I bet you, because we've been hearing you this morning. It's what's the, the new single is called Save the Lives. Save the Lives, that's right. And there's what? brackets, good to me. Oh, yeah, have I got to do the brackets? You bit? have to say the brackets. It? OK. <laughs> Welcome. How are you? Thanks. I'm good, thank you. How, How are you? was your weekend? Were you a busy girl? Yeah, it was good. I was at V, so um, I got to see a bit of Lenny, which was fun. Yes, Lenny Crowds was and, there. Um, yeah, played a few times around the festival. Yep. Played a few acoustic sets as well, so it was fun. It so, was cool. you know, you're 16 years of age and you're playing V. <laughs> and then in October, you've got your own tour. Yeah, that's right. We're going around Europe and kind of, yeah, touring around. It's my first headlining tour, so it should be pretty fun. So do you have a supporting act as well? Do you yeah, have... I have a supporting act this time because, you know, I've supported quite a few people. Supported Sugar Babes on their last tour and James Blunt in Australia. And, um... Yeah, it's nice to have support act because sometimes you'll be like put in a dressing room on like the sixth floor of the building and the stage is on the first floor. You can't find your way to the yeah, stage. Saying, yeah, and by the time you get to the stage, you're all puffed out. Yeah, like... excuse me, I, I, can you tell me where the stage is? I'm supposed to be on right now. Yeah, exactly. So this is all very exciting uh, at the moment. I've got to see some of this, um, this clanking. When I shook your hand when you arrived on the sofa here, that's more medals than your Olympic team have won, I think you got on there. <laughs> That one on the right-hand side. Never have enough bling. Never, that one. Ne never enough bling. Are you loving what you're doing at the moment? Yeah, it's really cool. It's cool. I love to travel and like you know see different different things and like you know playing at all the festivals like you know at Glastonbury I got to see like Leonard Cohen and you know John Mayer and. See, they got to see you. Know, you. They got to see me. I'm not sure. But, uh, that would be cool. That, that, that's one way yeah. to look at it. Where do, where do you see yourself in sort of in two or three years' time? How big do you think this whole thing? Two could or three become? years. I think I'll probably be on. Um, my second album, maybe writing my third album. Yeah. Second album, writing my third album. I love to play like Carnegie Hall one day, in Madison Square Garden, something like that. But maybe, maybe I set myself five years. Yeah. But then again, I like setting myself high. Well, high goals, you've so. achieved so much already. It's going to be your 17th birthday during your tour, isn't it? Yeah, I think I'm in Germany or something doing doing a TV that day or something. Really? Some, but, some um, of the venues you play, not even supposed to probably have under 18s, I would have thought, but that's, it's just fantastic. <laughs> Wonderful. Cool. The very best of luck. I know you're going to go and get ready now and uh, get ready for the single after the break, so yep. good luck. The rehearsal sounded brilliant. Cool. Thank Gabriella you. Chung. Gabriella Chill will be performing her new single live in just a moment, but first...
16 year olds nowadays. 16? Huh? 17 on her I headlining tour. I thought she was with tour. dolls at 16. I certainly exactly didn't have that right. kind of Things poison. Have Put your oh, questions gosh. to uh, Gabriella. She's doing a live webcast at 9.30 uh, this morning. That's on GM.TV. Gabriella, thank you very much indeed. Unbelievable. Okay, now let's talk about Kenya.